Hello friends, today I'll be giving you the top 10 best female figure skaters of all time. Let's get straight to the list. At number 10, Oksana Bayul. Oksana is a Ukrainian skater who at the age of 15 became the 1993 world champion. At the 1993 European Championships, she brought home the silver medal for lady singles as well. At the 1994 Olympics, Oksana earned the gold medal outskating Chen Lu and Nancy Kerrigan to be Olympic champion. Oksana will always be remembered for being the first female skater to win the Olympic championship for the Ukraine and being the first Ukrainian to become champion in any Olympic sport. At number 9, Midori Ito. Midori is a nine-time Japanese champion. She also was the 1989 world champion, and at the 1992 Olympics, she brought home the silver medal. Midori was the first skater who landed a triple-triple jump combination and a triple axle in competition in 1988. Midori will always be remembered for her amazing jumps and being the first Asian skater to bring home a world title. At number eight, Tara Lipinski. Tara is an American skater who made history at the 1997 World Championships by being the youngest skater to earn a gold medal at the age of only 14. Just one year later, at the 1998 Olympics, Tara made history again, being the youngest person to earn an Olympic gold medal in Lady Single at the age of 15. That record was broken in 2014 by Yulia Lipnitskaya, who was only six days younger than Tara when she won the title. Tara is also a two-time Grand Prix Finals champion. At number seven, Christy Yamaguchi. Christy is an American skater who started her Paris career in 1986 with partner Rudy Galindo, where they won the junior title at the U.S. Championships. In 1987, the pair earned a bronze medal at the Junior World Championships, and at the 1988 Junior World Championships, Christy and Rudy brought home the gold, and Christy also received the goal for lady singles. At the 1991 World Championships, Christy became world champion, bringing home the goal for lady singles. Christy also received the gold at the 1992 World Championships as well. In the same year, at the 1992 Olympics, Christy earned another gold medal for lady singles. At number six, Michelle Kwan. Michelle is an American skater and possibly one of the most decorated female skaters of all time. Michelle won eight consecutive United States Championship medals and earned 12 United States Championship medals altogether. Michelle is also a five-time world champion and she also received three silver medals at worlds as well in the 1997 olympics michelle received a silver medal and at the 2001 olympics she brought home the bronze michelle is also one of the highest paid american female skaters of all time at number five peggy fleming Peggy is an American skater who started skating at the age of 9, but tragedy struck when she was 12. Her coach and 16 members of the United States skating team perished in a plane crash. Around 7 years later, many people considered Fleming as the only hope for the American ladies figure skating team, and Peggy did not disappoint, winning 5 US titles and 3 world championship titles. And at the 1968 Olympics, Peggy brought home the gold. Peggy will always be remembered for being one of the greatest classic figure skaters of all time. At number 4, Carol Heiss. Carol is an American skater who started her competitive career at the age of 11, winning the U.S. Novice Ladies title. Then she won the U.S. Junior Ladies title in 1952. Carol is a four-time consecutive United States skating champion, and she also received the silver medal four years in a row as well. Carol is also a five-time consecutive world champion, and Carol had became one of three women to have won five consecutive world titles. At the 1956 Olympics, Carol received the silver medal, but at the 1960 Olympics, Carol brought home the gold. After Carol Carol finished her skating career, she went on to become a famous actress. At number 3, Katarina Witt. Katarina is a German skater who was an 8 time consecutive East German figure skating champion and a 6 time consecutive European figure skating champion. Katarina is also a 4 time world champion and she received the silver twice at Worlds as well. Katarina made her Olympic debut at the 1984 Olympics where she brought home the gold. She also received the gold at the 1988 Olympics as well. Katarina will always be remembered for being one of the most competitive skaters of all time. At number 2, Sonia Henney. Sonia is a Norwegian skater and possibly one of the most iconic figure skaters of all time. The name Sonia Henney is synonymous to winning. Sonia is a three-time consecutive pairs Norwegian figure skating champion. Now let's get to her singles career. Sonia is a seven-time consecutive Norwegian figure skating champion and a six-time consecutive European figure skating champion. I'm amazed to say Sonia was also a 10-time consecutive world champion. At the 1928, 1932, and 1936 Olympics, Sonia received the gold every time, making her a three-time consecutive Olympic champion. Sony was inducted into the World Figure Skating Hall of Fame in 1976.
and at number 1, the greatest female skater of all time, Yuna Kim. Kim is a Korean figure skater who began skating at the age of 6. In 2006, Kim was a Junior Grand Prix Finals champion. Also in 2006, she brought home the gold for the Junior World Championships. Kim is a three-time consecutive Grand Prix Finals champion, and at Worlds, she received two gold medals, two silver medals, and two bronze medals. At the 2010 Olympics, Kim received a gold medal, and at the 2014 Olympics, she received a silver medal. Kim was the former world record holder for the ladies combined total score and she set that record three times and held it for the longest time. Kim was also the world record holder for the ladies short program score and she set that record five times and held it for the longest time as well. She was also the former world record holder for ladies free skate score and she set that record three times and she held it for the longest time also. Kim was the first figure skater to achieve a career grand slam under the current ISU judging system. She's also the first female single skater to win gold in all the major ISU championships. Kim was the first female skater to break the 200 point, 210 point, and 220 point mark in ladies combined total in international competition. She was the first female skater to break the 75 point mark in ladies short program in international competition. And finally, she was the first female skater to break the 140 and 150 point mark in ladies free skate total in international competition. So Kim will always be remembered for being the first and only female figure skater to never finish off podium in her entire career, earning her the title as the greatest female figure skater of all time. So, who do you think is the greatest female figure skater of all time? Leave your thoughts in the comments below. And if you like this video and want to see more like it, please like and subscribe. As always, it's your favorite neighborhood movie critic. Thank you for tuning in and see you next time.